My name is Nivesh Ramdani. I am the racecourse manager of Royal Randwick Racecourse in Sydney. Today I'm going to take you through the Royal Randwick Racecourse spring renovation for 2016. So there's three stages to this renovation process. The first is to mow the track down to 50 mils. The second is to scarify the track and remove any uh, thatch or dead grass material that's just on the surface of the track. And then the third stage involves the sand grooving and that will commence immediately after the scarifying is done. The reason we sand grooving is just to complement the current drainage system that is in the track. Uh, we have seen autumn can throw a bit of curve balls with the weather. So what we're doing is trying to help the track drain just that little quicker on the surface uh, so they can get us through the race meeting in a better track rating. What the sand grooving machine does is it cuts little trenches 20 millimeters wide and about 150 mils deep and it injects pure sand into that trench. What that does is help drain the surface that much quicker. If we do have a wet lead into the autumn carnival, these drains will activate, it will help dry, dry out the surface that much quicker, and it will help improve the track conditions leading into a race meeting. So this sand grooving on the course proper will be from the extreme inside all the way to the outside rail and around the entire track. So it's gonna be consistently uh, installed around the track and that should help the entire track drain that much quicker. The sand grooving machine also comes with the added benefit that it aerates the track at the same time. So apart from just sand grooving, we're also going to aerate the profile right across and down to at least 150 mils deep. Both those aspects are going to help not just drainage, but also enhance the vigor and growth of the grass on the course proper. And I believe that's going to provide a superior racing surface come the Autumn Carnival 2017. Now that the sand grooving is complete, we will embark on a massive fertilizer program to make sure that the track is absolutely perfect come Villiers Day. Apart from fertilizers, we also would actively check for any pests, disease and weeds that may emerge through this period and we knock them out as soon as we see them.